Okay. Could you tell us your name, please? Brenda Gooden. And what project are you working on, Brenda? This is a sculptured head from cement. Okay. Can you see, can we see your process a little bit here? Bas yeah. Basically, chiseling, marking an area and then chiseling it. And it just continues to evolve too from what I might have in mind as, like for instance, the ear might change 10 times before I'm through. So it, it, it's really a process and I absolutely love it. So um, what is your uh, influence in, in this project? I actually went off of this which I believe is from the Mayan culture. Mm -hmm. And because I had to have some kind of guidelines, so I loosely followed that. And, uh, okay. Cool. Very cool. So, um, why does art matter to you? For, for me, uh, it's serenity. Art is my saving grace. It, it just, you know, it's something. Uh, that stirred a passion late in life that I'll probably do forever. Great. You know. Wonderful. Yeah. Thank you. Hi. Hi. State your name, please. My name is Colette Chante. Okay. What are you working on, Colette? I am working on carving a cement stone head. Okay. And can you tell us a little bit about your process? And the process is <coughs> aiming, really aiming, then hammering, and then that slowly creates your outline. And once you get deeper into the stone, you can create more details as okay. you go. Okay. How long have you been working on this? Uh, off and on for about three weeks. Okay. Good development. <laughs> and uh, why is art so important to you? Art is important to me because it's something that brings joy to me and it's something I'm passionate about. Okay. And it's also a stress reliever. Okay. Great. Thank you. You're welcome. Can you say who you are? Hello, I'm Carly Jacobs. And what project are you working on, Carly? I am working on a wire person. And can you talk about your process a little bit? Well, I'm grabbing the wire and I have to wrap it around in order to create the form. And I'm pretty much just going with the flow. I started adding colored wire just a few minutes ago, seeing where it's taken me. So trying to add the form. Okay. And what's your goal in this? I'm not really sure. To tell you the truth. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I want to make something cool towards the end. He's going to stand, just, right? Oh, he's going to have to. Yeah. I don't know. I just want to create something. So why is art important to you? Because I feel like no one can take it away from me. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Of course. Hi. Hi. Who, who are you? I'm Nicole Dowson. <laughs> Can you tell us what you're working on? I am working on my wire dude. Um, it's kind of like a uh, large 3D gesture drawing. Okay. We're going to be trying to bulk them up and give them form and movement if possible and some kind of emotive. Uh, emotional quality or action or something. Okay. So I'm using all of these different wires to try to fill him in. Um, got different colors and uh, recycling uh, Dad's uh, junkyard. And, uh, uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun. Cool. A little bit of problem solving here. 
Okay. Trying to figure out how to give me a green. Okay. Why is art important to you? <clears throat> um, off the top of my head, it's uh, therapeutic for me. Um, I have a long, busy week working, got a kid and stuff like that, and uh, so the brain's constantly rushing. Uh, this relaxes me, puts me in a different place so that I can kind of relax and more intuitive and less thinking, even though thinking is involved. I have to figure out how to get my brain, how to bolt them up and stuff, but while you're doing it, it's very relaxing. Great. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Could you state your name, please? Um, I'm Dilly Formolo. Okay. Could you tell, give us a little uh, discussion on what you're doing there? And so we're working on linear perspective. I'm doing a two-point perspective drawing. And I'm using this giant ruler to get my angles right by drawing all of my lines to these vanishing points. We're doing a cityscape. Okay. Great. Are you enjoying it? Partly. I like <laughs> a little bit more freedom, but it's good practice. Yes. Tell me what is important to you in regards to art. Um, the freedom of it. In like this day and age, I feel like everything's so mass-produced and so controlled. I think it's important to have a creative outlet that you can kind of do whatever you want. Great. Thank you. Hi. Hello. Can you state your name, please? I'm Timothy James here. I'm working on <clears throat> a demon bunny face for Easter. And since I had this white clay, it definitely reminded me of stuff like that. I have some sketches here. It's going to be nice and scary. I'm studying skulls, werewolves, rats even. There's some sketches of the mouth. We'll see. Kind of blending them all together. Some real parts, some really not. <laughs> What kind of clay are you using? It's uh, plastilina. It's an oil-based clay, so it takes a long time to dry out. It gives you plenty of time to kind of mally it, and I don't really want to move this. I want to edit this, and it's very workable. and gives you some time versus some water-based clay. Okay. It's very good to work with. So why is art important to you? Well, I love to create. Um, you know, it's, it just brings me great joy to kind of put something out in the world that no one's really seen before, and it's kind of a part of me, kind of like showing someone part of myself. And it's definitely what I want to do with my career, you know? Um, it's a famous saying, if you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. So I want to be paid to create, to kind of have ideas out of my head into the real world and share it with the world. Great. Thanks. Of course. Hi. Hello. Tell us your name, please. I am Brenlyn Klein, and this is Henry. He is my art baby. And what is Henry? What's he, he made out is of? A, um, he's a sculpture made out of plaster, and he is a biomorphic form made through intuitive process. And yeah. So, so first, we mix the plaster, and then we put it in a bag. And then we set up the bag, and then we had it uh, dry out, and then we took it out, and then we kind of just go with the flow and sculpt it into a thing that's not really supposed to be anything. Okay. Oh, great. So can you tell us why art is important to you? Art is important to me because it's a way of expressing yourself, and it's something that I can make my own and nobody can take it away from me. So um, I think that's really important for people to have like an outlet where they can express themselves and not be judged for it or anything because there are no rules to art. So, yeah. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, what was the other thing we talked about is that's, that art is important for? Fun. fun. Most important, it's fun. <laughs> what was that again? It's, it's fun. fun. Thank you.